welcome back to another video today we have the Makita 40 volt XGT against the Milwaukee fuel brushless gen 4 don't forget to help this channel by subscribing hitting the like hitting the bell icon so we can buy more tools like this make more to review videos that's the way youtubers platform by subscribers likes so help at this channel by doing so all right yes guys you guys know this is a 40 volt tool this is one of the better ones that they make this is the top of the line XGT brushless we got Makita brushless motor we got hammer mode uh, this one we have two speeds we do have uh, drilling a screw mode and a hammer mode and the clutch settings on this one it's it's different it's not like your normal so you put it here on uh, drilling mode and you go down here to the clutch settings and you do hold on to this button Alright, so once you hold on to that one, you can switch from uh, all the settings that it has. Alright, so on speed 2, you got 21 settings. On speed 1, 41 settings. So lots of uh, precise movement on this. It is a digital uh, clutch. The latest technology out there. Uh, it does have a lot of air movements, a lot of ventilation here. Uh, this black part is rubber and the brushless XGT 40 volt. This is a 2.5 amp hour battery. Uh, other than that, it's very similar, a little bigger than your normal batteries, Makita batteries. A 90 watt hour battery at 36 volts to 40 volt max. Connectors there, we got GPH01. GPH01 concrete, we got 0 to 650. And then we got 0 to 2,600. 2, yeah, we got 0 to 650 and 0 to 2,600. So it's a little faster. runs a little faster than uh, other drills. This is made in China. Makita Corporation in uh, Japan. And this does have a nice LED light. All right, so that one does not have the auto stop. Uh, this one does. So you guys do see right there. Uh, we got the fuel brushless. Uh, this is the Gen 4. This is the 2904-20. This is made in China. Uh, we got a nice rubber uh, over mold here. Uh, all this black is uh, rubber. Got some nice stops. Uh, new design here. We got uh, 16 clutch settings. We got a drilling mode, hammer mode, and then the drilling mode uh, metal clutch. We got two speeds. Got a nice plastic and metal uh, handle down here. We got a six amp hour lithium high output battery of a zero to 500 and then we have a zero to 2100 per minute second speed and we're going to be using drilling mode Half an inch drill bit We do a hole right here one two three go All right, we got a one inch Diablo spade bit. One, two, three, go. All right, we're gonna do a hole right here. This is a one inch hogger bit. One, two, three, go. I really like the sound of this one. It sounds really smooth. I could use this tool all day. Uh, this one we got a three quarter inch socket and we got a four and a half by half an inch lag screw all right we're gonna drilling mode one two three go take this off one two three go Alright guys, obviously you guys did see the results. I was surprised when I saw the results too. I can tell you is that, you know, the Gen 3 feels really good 
It was really powerful. Uh, however, the Makita is just like a really nice tool to use. It's, I mean, you could use that all day. It's really nice, really smooth, uh, ergonomically and uh, power-wise. There's enough power, get you going, get you that job done and quick. Uh, yeah, guys, let me know that what you guys think down in the comment section. Don't forget to help this channel by subscribing, hitting the like, hitting the bell icon so we can buy more tools like this, make more review of videos, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching.